everyone. In lesson one, I show you how to deal with the crystal structure of uh, a mob. In here, I would like to show you how to present um, the bore of the structure and distinguish the linker in case of um, the fact that you have one uh, one linker but very complicated structure or you have more than one kind of linker in the structure let's say you have a mixture of linker which uh, construct a complex uh, middle only framework that you need to recognize them clearly so I, I, I will show you how to do that so let's start with the um, the reverse um, file of the mob file so here is the structure so and then for example we want to show specific kind of region so first of all we we put the structure at the A direction and then we move to the model and then I turn off the perspective I will make it smaller to fit my screen and then let's say I want to show only one kind of coop instead of showing a, a lot of coops so to do that you can use this um, the selection tool to choose from sorry from uh, from here to here so if you want to show the selected region you can right click and then you hide unselected items or you want to show unselected item then you need to hide selection so here we want to show the selection so we will have to hide unselected items click to that and then you move the direction to B and then you do the same thing another tool for selection you can use is laser tool for laser tool you can do something like this very quickly then you hide everything except for the selected one and now you have a, only one coup of morphi representing a smaller bore the one the one consist is consisted from from the um, the fenoring uh, void toward each other so let me hide the unit cell to make it clearer so here is only one coop the smaller one and for the second um, purpose the one that you want to show um, you want to distinguish the linker in in, uh, in case of you have a very complex structure or you have a mixture of linker so to do that I normally do I choose fenoring and then selection make polyheron and I put it center and I show if you you choose to show symmetry related item you will have all of the thing related to the symmetry of that position will be shown otherwise you only see one position so I recommend you to use all balls in this distant range so that you can see everything in the in this uh, distant range can connect to the center item and you will see you have a field fenoring ring that can distinguish the linker perfectly with um, the cluster then you go to model go back to the item style and one thing you 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 have to do is you have to rechoose the spear and stick ball to make to make everything perfect 
and the next one you move to the bond you uncheck you make the bond between the center of the um, phenol ring to the carbon to be blank so that you can hide the connection between the carbon to the center item here is the the, the fuel ring so imagine that if you have two or three kinds of linkers in the structure by distinguishing them by using the few phenol ring you can distinguish them very very easy so I would like to change the color to yellow and now you see you have a very nice group of morphine so next one you want to show the bond uh, sorry you want to show the uh, the bore of a structure let's say you have a, a group like this and the bore is the center of this group that means is in the center of eight oxygen atom which located at the center of every single zinc cluster so you have to choose one you press shift during the, uh, the selection to choose more item one two three four five six seven and last one and selection make polyheron so here let's say we put it selenium and then we don't need to generate a bond between the oxygen center centering at the uh, at the center of zinc cluster to that's uh, the pore so so in order to do that instead of choose this one we choose no bond and we don't need to show symmetry related item because we only have show one group in the structure so I uncheck this one and then okay and next one you have to do is you move to the item style and then you choose style of selenium to be spear and you can change the size of the sphere to be fit with the um, with the uh, distance between the center to the phenol ring from here to here I put it around 18 for example yeah and then this one make it orange perfect something like that so and next one we save let's say you when you save it you can save the file to be cmdf which can be opened next time by crystal maker or and then you export graphic to be very high resolution image Let's see.